Hi fellow traders, what's happening? This is our morning recap here in the AJT jungle. Um, we started out our day with MRNA. We were playing the aggressive entry in the first five minutes. Um, you can see we got in, got my first target, but my sec, but well, the, the when I was trying to get the first order out, it got rejected. I was trying to get out up here, but by the time I was able to get my order through, we had pulled all the way back, at least a dollar, and then it came back and stopped me out break even. Most of these aggressive entries are going to give us one initial big push. We get whatever we can get out of it, and then we sit back and wait for the market to settle. Um, basically, that's what I was doing here, but I missed taking out, getting in on the five-minute opening range breakdown. I missed that. So as we were up here, I was saying, okay, well, if it bounces a little bit and retests this level, I want to get in. So I went to put a um, sell stop in up here, and it didn't it didn't take well what I did I messed up and accidentally sent the order without changing the price and it automatically put it on the ask and it filled so it just shorted on the ask it filled and so I went ahead to see if we were going to get down to um, red to green it tried and as it can it failed a couple of times I went ahead and took profit here and then it came and it tried to get through again and it didn't and you know we ended up taking it off here close to break even um, it did bounce pull back um, this is considered a failed trade even though we made money on it it was a failed entry this was not the entry I wanted so it, it just it wasn't right so over here this is the, the perfect entry we closed below red to green. This candle confirmed. I got in. I'm always expecting a back test. I'm never expecting the stock to work in my favor immediately. It rarely ever does. Um, unless you're scalping and you're looking to get 10, 15 cents. That's a whole different ball game. But that's, you know, I've got my own thoughts on that. But. Um, this was the, the great entry had to wait for it to pull back you can see it did not take out the high so it never reclaimed this level so we don't take the trade off we let the trade work technically it was still in play and ended up getting my first target and as soon as it hit it just ripped right back up and took me out you know near break even and that was that on MRNA um, the other trade I took was on Amazon. Um, you can see Amazon was five minute opening range breakdown. It sold off, got stuck here. When I say it got stuck, it got stuck big time. And when I saw the shift in the price action, I went ahead and took it off. And you can see what happened here. It if you're reading price action, if you're watching the candlestick formation and you're watching what's happening on the chart, you don't need anything else. You know, you just need to read this and it tells you everything you need to know. Um, so I took this off. It did, you know, bounce. It came back and did make a move, but I was trading some other stocks I thought were giving me better options. So I never got back in this. So a little, you know, a little bunt, I would call it, on Amazon. It just, just a little drizzle out to the, to the mound. Um, and MRNA was the, the biggest trades for me. You could see um, here, oh, we already talked about that. Let's go back. Tesla. That's the last one. Alright, so Tesla I got in here. It was an aggressive entry. 
um, tried to take it to red the through red to green just like um, mRNA but it didn't quite get there I took profit and ended up taking it off here break even and then went to get it on the break here I asked this was an accidental entry but I did give it a shot and when it couldn't push I went ahead and took it off I was gonna see if it would make it up to this 156 this was the entry a break of 156 but I for, I don't know what I was looking at but I was looking at something wrong so this was a trading error on my part um, then we waited once we confirmed taking out the linear regression channel we got short again I always expect a bounce and you know or pullback and in this case we got a little bounce um, it never claimed the level I based the trade off of so technically the trade still in play um, just had to give it some patience and here um, hit the first target right now we're waiting for it to sell through um, 145.50 is the next target and we're working our way there we're trying to work through 146 now and next stop should be 145.50 um, the final target on this is the linear regression channel right here which is I can't see the price 143.34 so we're just taking profit along the way to that 143.34. If we get a definitive bounce and a rejection, can always add. So that's kind of where we're at right now. That's our morning. Uh, don't think we're going to have any earnings trades today. So, you know, this might be it. Should have cleared, you know, by this, all this is over with. We should have cleared maybe 12 to 1500 bucks um, on a day like today so not bad now if you guys aren't live with me in the AJT jungle you better email me I'm giving you guys free access this week that's my holiday gift to you you can come see what we do and see if this can help you be a better trader going into 2023 so take advantage of it um starting to lose my voice again had COVID all last week that's why you didn't hear from me but um if you want to hang out this week got a free week for you and just email me and i can send you everything that you need all right have a good one we'll see you tomorrow